There's tons of videos on wingsound.com and you can even upload some of your own. Yeah, there's tons, but here are some of the must watch from wingsound.com's community. Nick Tutorials talks about how to slice samples in Ableton Live and automating effect envelopes. So I'm going to zoom in even more and try to get this number one right on the start of the snare drum. That sounds pretty good. Now say I want to drop the frequency over a few of these hits. Again, it's as simple as double clicking, creating your envelope. Big Man Beats makes classic clap stacks on the MPC 1000. Hey, it's Big Man, I'm here to show you beats and other cool things. When you hear those super, real thick clap sounds, like you probably get them in sound kits and you hear like, basically what they're doing is they're just taking like a solo clap like this and they're just layering them together. It takes us into shaping our drum sounds. I can go to that three on the 3000 kick, go to level, hit window, and I'm gonna adjust the attack. The attack adjusts when when it hits, so I might adjust the decay at the end, so just using that thump, that pump, like right there, I like that. Ableton Vids takes us into Ableton to show us how to time stretch a song to fit the session's tempo. Click on the loop bar here, then I can use my page arrows up and down to scroll 16 bars at a time. Looks like we're a little bit off here, so I'll click here and double click, zoom out, Move this over, and then we'll start again. Okay, that sounds pretty good to me. Hey, thanks so much for hanging out with us. We hope you enjoyed it. And if you have any more questions, hit us up, rick at wingsound.com or mateo at wingsound.com. And remember to follow us on Twitter, at wingsound. Yeah, lots of cool stuff happening on Twitter. And of course, for more music production videos and tutorials, or to upload your own, go to wingsound.com, the new social video network for audio creators.